Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It is episode 26, and we're continuing our playthrough of Chrono Trigger. We went into the Reptite Lair, and we uh, knocked some people around. We received a wonderful gift of some higher-powered items from a couple of the critters that we ran across. And that should put everybody up to the best weapons and armor we can get them at this particular juncture in the game. And we should be at the point that we, uh, we're we ready to fi find out from uh, Nisbal and Azela what actually happens. So with all that said and done, let's, uh, let's go up the stairs. Oh, maybe there's more fight. Oh, no, here we go. What in the world? Could those filthy apes have crafted something this advanced? Um, hey. Zayla! And so the hairless apes arrive. Ah, and these new ones appear, cut from a finer cloth than Ayla. Perfect. This should make things easier. Tell me, apes, what is the purpose of this device? Sure, why not? Lies! Do you take me for a fool? No one would talk so easily if that were true. But perhaps this might loosen your tongues? Yeah, okay. Come, Nisbel. Do I hear the sound of a boss fight? Ah, uh, yeah. Looks like we got a dude that's got a shop over at the big and tall. <laughs> Alright, so let's open up with some lightning. Kind of hoping uh, Marley would uh, speed it up a little bit. I need to hit her with the speed tab. Defense lowered by electric shock. So this is when we go for Iceberg Toss. And we'll try to hit for a cleave maybe. Bam! Bam! Alright. Let's uh, hit him up with another lightning. We'll get another iceberg toss. And this should be over pretty quick. Now, that's kind of the point of grinding. I I like to power game when I'm gaming privately, but for these episodes and things, I really do try to keep it uh, more for the nostalgia than anything else. Oh, no. Electric discharge. Boom! That's okay. We can go combo. I gotta wait for uh, Marley combo or a whirl. And let's go ahead and have her do her oh, charm, because I think he's got something that you can get off M2. Might as well, right? Because I haven't hit him with a... Yeah, there we go. Get a third eye. Is it blind? I don't know if I want a third eye blind. <laughs> okay. I'll stop. Maybe. Lightning 2. And we'll hit up another Iceberg Toss. Stick your finger in the electric socket. Bam! Gone! Done! Well, that was hardly nothing. <laughs> 500, that's it, 500 XP, 10 tech points. Okay, Ayla's level went up, though. That's always nice. The apes beat Nisbal. Give thing back Chrono now. Almost Yoda talk. Very well. You've won today, but know that we Reptites are the rulers of this world. We'll not surrender it to you, filthy apes. I'm not an animal. I am a human. Sorry. The good Planet of the Apes reference. With Charlton Heston. Is the gate key alright? Oh, thank goodness. It looks like it's okay. Um... Of everybody in my party, you're not the one I'm actually going to trust an objective look at that at. I'd rather have Luca or Robo look at it if, you know, everything's the same to you. Azela, come anytime. Ayla, no. 
Uh, uh, what was that all about? Corona leave? No Corona. Ayla, no fun. Um, <laughs> thanks, Ayla. I learned a lot from you. Like how to drink, apparently. Sorry, Chrono. Kino tried to be strong now. Even more strong, Chrono. Come again, Chrono. Have party. Drink, eat, dance, fight, fun. Sorry, Chrono. Kino tried to be strong now. Okay. Is this going to be the same? Yeah. Okay. I meant to check on that. All right. Uh, sweet. Do I need to... Yes, I do need to hit up the healing waters. So let's go over... Was it here? Yeah, let's go over here. And that's the other thing. So you trade your petals, fangs, and all that other fun stuff with the old guy in the middle. And then you come to this guy here where he says, trade your shiny stone. And you can sell him anything you've got. And so that's a nice way to get, uh, to get, <laughs> to get some good stuff. All right, so I've got two ruby vests in stock. I'm going to sell one of them, so that way I've got one for frog. Two stone helms in stock, so I'm going to sell one of them, so I've got one for frog. The shaman's bow I no longer need, so I'm going to sell that. The magma hand I don't need, so I'm going to sell both of those. The Primeval Blade, I've already got equipped, so I'm going to sell the other two there. The Mop, I've already uh, had my fun with, demonstrating and showing that it's a thing. So I'm going to go ahead and sell that. Not like I can't get it again if I want it. All right. Stone Arm is a step down, so let's sell that. Ruby Gun is a step down, let's sell that. The Mammoth Tusk is a step down, so let's sell that. And the Dreamstone Gun is what she's got right now, so let's sell the other two. And now, we are rolling in some coin, which is going to be nice. I kind of wish this guy sold uh, shelters, because I'd be tempted to buy a couple right now, but... Whatever. All right, so that's taken care of. Now we head down this way. And if I remember right, it is this hut here. And we talk to the lady with the uh, happy water. And we get our magic points and hit points restored. And now we should be able to head back up to the mountains. And yeah, I think the entrance is down here. I think I walked to the wrong mountains. There we go. <laughs> Oops. Now, if you're not a, if if you're playing on your own and you really want to get your level up a little bit higher, now is the perfect time to go back into the hunting ground and grind some more news. Uh, since I don't really want to, I don't want to make this grinding again with a non-junior. I'm going to skip that part. Just know that uh, when the next opportunity arises, guess where I'm going to be. Especially since that gives me, now that I got the full party, I can start working on getting these guys their Antipode 2. Because I think they both got, uh, she's got Ice 2 and Fire 2. Those are the prereqs. So the next battle these guys get in, I should be able to get Antipode Bomb 2. And I should be able to work on a couple other of the uh, dual techs that I haven't had a chance to get with these guys yet. As a matter of fact, let's fight our way all the way to the back. All right, so let's go ahead and hit them with lightning and antipode bomb. Oh, that is a single tech. Interesting. All right, so let's just hit ice two, fire two, if they live that long. Of course, here I am soaking up all the hits. Bam. And just by virtue of being in a battle together with the appropriate spells, they should have... Same pedal. Learned Antipode Bomb 2 Dual Tech. Learned Delta Force Triple Tech. Yeah. Matter of fact. Let's try that out. 
So, I need, for the triple techs, all three of them have to be ready, which means you may end up having to soak some attacks like that. And we come down here to Delta Force, and they hit them with everything. It's glorious. Lightning, fire, and ice. Bam. That's how you clear some people out. Although it uses up a fair amount of magic points, so I wouldn't go... I wouldn't go using it all willy-nilly. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and go to the party. Let me switch Luca out for Robo so they can catch up on their dual techs. Combo. And uh, we'll just hit Lightning 2. Ice 2. Sure. We'll toss that in the mix, even though I think they're going to be dead before then. And by virtue of being in a battle together, they should learn something new, if I remember right. 84 XP, 4 tech, pedal. No? Thought they had a, uh, hang on. Let me put a bookmark in ye old Nintendo Power Guide. And yes, I do mean it is an old Nintendo Power Guide. And let's go to the menus real quick. And let's get to the right page. That is double text. And Marley. Marley and Robo. Aura Beam. My studio lights are causing a more than marginal amount of glare. All right, so ice and tackle. So they should have... Marley and Robo should have Aura Beam and Ice Tackle. Alright. Aura Beam and Ice Tackle. Okay. And what's their next one? Their next one is Cure Touch, which requires Marley to have Cure 2. And Robo to have heal. Alright, he's got heal. She just doesn't have cure too, so I gotta get her up to that. Okay. Um, then, in that case, let me go to the party and let me swap these two and see if... Uh, I guess since I got the stuff up. Uh, where's Luca and Robo? They should have fire punch, fire tackle... And they don't have the right spells for Double Bomb. So we got Fire Punch. They're missing Fire Tackle. Alright, so they should be able to get that somewhere up here. Because I think they've got everything they need to make that happen. So, let's lightning them all here. Oh man, Luca is slow. I, that's what I need to do. Uh, when I get to the end of time, I need to get Marley and Luca in the party together and have them hit up a uh, the speed tabs that I've been saving. Dane Horn. Chrono learned Frenzy. Ooh, nice. Learn Fire Tackle Dual Tech. Fire Sword 2. Learn Ring of Fire Triple Tech. Ooh, I forgot about that one. All right, so Frenzy. Strikes four, uh, strikes enemy four times in succession. Okay, that. So we go from cyclone to cleave to frenzy. Nice. All right, we got our fire tackle and fire punch, and we got the next fire sword, which is nice. A ring of fire. I feel like I should be singing some Johnny Cash too. No, I won't do that to you. Cleave fire two and laser spin. Sweet. All right. So they are about as caught up as they can be. Then let me go back. And, um... Huh. They should have Aura Beam. Ice Tackle. Okay, yep, 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 yep. What's the triple tech, then? No oh, bother. The lighting... The lighting. Uh, Chrono, Marley, and 
Chrono Marley Luca, Chrono Lifeline. Okay. So we need Cyclone Life 2 and Laser Spin. Okay. So Marley has got to get Life 2. Or Cure 2. Cure 2? Life 2? Cure 2 is up next. So, um, all right. I guess we'll uh, travel these three together. Although I don't think there's any more battles. So, you know what? Just because I like having this party together. <laughs> Especially since the next little bit should be some story stuff. Jump down. Yep. Whee! And trippy trip back to the end of time. All right, let's go to the thingy that restores all our hit points and magic points. Let's go ahead and hit up a save. Let's see if Gaspar has anything useful for us. Ah, uh, Dreamstone. I'd forgotten how beautifully it shone. There's a man who knows the secret to working that stone. He resides near Medina, a village of fiends. Yeah, that is our next stop. But first, just out of kicks, let's see if we can take him on. Uh, level 25, that is halfway through the band. See, the current form that he's in right now is what you'll get from 20 through 29. I was really hoping to take him on about, you know, 28-ish, just to see. Just to keep it at the high end to make the fight easier. But, I got a couple minutes before I start the next one. So let's go here and... What do you want? Are you looking for some practice? Why, yes I am. Because he gives you a fresh set of prizes each time you beat him at a new form. All right. Oh, I should have hit them up with their uh, speed tabs. Don't. Okay, a little too late now. Combo. Delta Force. Hit him hard. Ooh. Especially since Chrono and Luca are already low. I probably should have done an Aura Beam. But, um, because I don't think that's enough to really sap them. Bam. Yep. Okay. Oot. And he's the one that has the, uh, res. Oh, okay. I'm not going to burn items for this one either. Alright, some fire and ice. There's a fire and rain. Fire and rain. No, uh, I won't do that. Yeah, no, this is over. This is over. I probably should also have Luca hit everybody up with a protect. But again, I'm about halfway through the level that you should be at when doing that. Okay, good. Everybody's back to health and all that. So, oh, just for kicks, let's go to inventory. And potion, ether, mini ether, high potion. Oh, it's just the strength of magic capsules that I got. Ooh. <laughs> 31, 30, 16, 24, 16. Uh, let's go ahead and bump that up. At least one more. I need to... I need to see where Frog is before I go to any more. Um... And probably with Frog and Robo, I'll take a look at the uh, strength tabs. Alright, uh, so where is Medina Village? Go to Medina Village, 1000 AD. Why, yes, yes I will. Hello, we come from Narnia again. All right, um... Oh, great Magnus. All right, I'm not going to try fighting with any of the shopkeepers or any of that stuff just yet. What I am going to do is, because that took just a little bit longer than I wanted, is I'm going to go ahead... 
over to the credits and say thank you for joining along so far. If you're watching live on Twitch or Mixer, hang tight. There's still more to come. If you want to watch live, I stream on Thursdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already, follow in Twitch or Mixer to get notified when I go live. And definitely, definitely subscribe to the YouTube channel. It helps the channel and you'll get notified when new episodes and other content get posted. So live folks, give me a minute to prep the next episode. YouTube folks, I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>